Hi there, in this video I'm going to show you a couple of things just on visualising um, your map in a, in a different way just to perhaps create some cooler visualisations of your um, maps um, and you may not know about these tools uh, they're um, the raster function uh, surface raster function hillshade which creates this sort of pseudo 3D effect uh, as you can see the sort of valleys and peaks and troughs and stuff um, by setting position of the sun effectively and um, the other one is blending so I'm going to sort of take information from underneath here the RGB or the, all the information that, um, that, that's on the underlying uh, w this world navigation map the Esri base map and I'm going to kind of pull it through um, in, into this uh, which is different to just doing transparency so let's get started let's quickly make a hillshade map so you go to imagery raster functions raster function it's a surface function uh, and there you'll see lots of others to play with there but there you'll see hillshade and it is with that tiff this srtn shuttle data uh, it's just single uh, so so I'm, I'm i'm just basically sort of plonking the sun in the sky as a myth and that altitude and then um, generating shadow effective effectively uh, i'm going to z factor it up a bit just just to i'm going to emphasize i'm going to exaggerate the height information a bit so it shows up better but this is all you know sort of cosmetic stuff really in terms of what i want to show you so you see how um i've now got this this sort of 3d-ish effect um and i could have played with various other options there to to make slightly um you know make it darker or reposition the sun or what have you so certainly do you know do sort of have a play with that I'll just put them to one side so that's hillshade that's what hillshading does um, now but what I'd like to do is kind of extrapolate from the, the, the raster data underneath into this one um, so I'll just turn off the tiff so what you do there is it's called blending so that's in appearance and you see here you can set transparency but that's not actually what I really want to create I want to do the blending mode um, so when you layer blend there's lots of algorithms computational sort of processes here and it's all to do with light and dark I'm going to um, darken the image with a multiplier and really bring it forward so now you see how the kind of RGB data the, the raster data underneath has been brought into this um, 3D model uh, sorry I say 3D this pseudo 3D effect uh, and with the things over here still on the appearance tab the um, widgets over here sliders I could I could brighten it up a bit and bring things through you see I can um, do that and I can alter the contrast as well to create the sort of effect I want to you know I could really exaggerate things or, or what have you anyway um, that's all I wanted to show you that was hill shading and the um, layer blend button that can create some really nice effects for your maps uh, and ju just have a play really uh, I hope you find that useful thanks